We're going to place a sticker on your forehead. <laughs> In complete silence, stand up and group yourself. Okay, are we grouped? Yeah, for the most part? All right, what just happened? There's two people below that is not in our group. So there's two people that you've identified that not in our group. For the folks who are in green or in orange, um, how did it feel to do this? I felt sort of like I had no control over it, yeah. Yeah, so you felt like you had no control over it, yeah. I personally think it was more comfortable to be in a big group than to be oh, like yeah. in a group alone. For my two folks in the back, how did it feel for you to do this? It was weird, I was like, I don't know what part I was, like which uh, group I was with. I guess it was okay. So did anyone attempt or try to bring them into their group? I thought about it. You thought about it? Wow. I sent him I away. She did! Why did you do that? I wanted him to be here, I don't like people being alone. It's interesting, right, because I never asked anybody to group themselves by color, I just said to group yourselves, right? The group decided, all of you decided to do this. I never said by color. How can you kind of like avoid this happening at your school? Yeah, you could try to make friends with that person or walk with that person so they don't feel so alone. An invitation is a powerful thing. So even if you invite someone and they're not ready, continuously just being consistent with someone could ultimately result in them saying, yeah, sure, I will join you. We're gonna do this again, right? So group yourself. In silence. In silence. Just group yourself. <laughs> All right, are we grouped? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All right, awesome. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Unlearning, Breaking Bias, Building Community is a CPTV partnership production with the National Conference for Community and Justice.